Welcome to IC3D training video, Transforming 3D Objects. IC3D provides a toolbar that enables you to transform 3D objects being created in the 3D view. These tools consist of Transform and Move, Scale, and Rotation tools, each displayed with a tool handle. These are used in conjunction with the Transform window that provides additional functionality when each tool is selected. To show how these can be used, select the Drink Bottle 4-Pack model from the Model Library and drag it into the 3D view. The model components appear in the Object Editor, which consists of four individual bottles with a wrapper to project artwork labels. Select the top-line component of the model in Object Editor, and the Transform window shows the width, height, and depth dimensions and positions. Select the Transform tool in the menu bar and a set of guides will appear centered on the object in the 3D view. The red arrow moves the object right and left. The green arrow moves the object up and down. And the blue dot moves the object forward and back. The Transform window also has X, Y, and Z axis coordinate fields to configure the object's movement. There are six help buttons to aid in movement. Plus and minus width buttons, height buttons, and depth buttons, which, when selected, moves the object to width, height, or depth size increments. A duplicate button, when activated, adds another model to the 3D view when a help button is selected. In order to create a drinks bottle 12-pack visualization, These actions can be undone using the toolbar tools. The Transform Scale tool can enlarge the object non-uniformly. The red arrow scales the object width. The green arrow scales the object height. The blue dot scales the object depth. The Transform window also has width, height, and depth coordinate and actual size fields to configure the object scale individually. The size and position data updates in the window as each of these fields are changed. A Scale Altogether checkbox will scale all the fields uniformly as each percentage field is changed, which displays in the 3D view. The arrow guides can also be used in the 3D view to uniformly scale the object, the changes of which are displayed in the Transform window fields. Additional buttons in the Transform window are used to center, ground, or reset the object to its original size and position in the 3D view. Selecting the Transform Rotate tool in the toolbar displays gyroscopic rotation guides around the object in the 3D view. The green guide rotates the object around a 360-degree turn. The red guide rotates the object front and back. And the blue guide rotates the object from side to side. The Transform window also has X, Y, and Z axis coordinate fields to rotate the object which also update as the gyroscopic guides are used. There are six help buttons to aid rotation. Plus and minus 90 degree buttons can be selected on each axis to rotate the object by plus or minus 90 degree increments in the 3D view. Additional buttons in the transform window are used to center, ground, or reset the object to its original position in the 3D view. The toolbar includes a Record a Movie icon at the top right. Selecting the icon starts the record function, which shows red. You are then able to undertake multiple transformations of the object, as well as being able to turn the object around the 3D view using the Selection tool. All these actions will be recorded. To end the recording, the user presses the Record a Movie icon again. A video export window appears with a video quality drop-down menu. 
The video can be saved in a PC, Mac, iPad, or iPhone compatible with Format Movie File. Name and save the video. A View Video option is displayed so that you can immediately view the video result, which shows all the transformations that you have undertaken. This completes the IC3D training video transforming 3D objects.